preparations complete on your end? Yep. Beam us up anytime. You're so energetic, Neptune. Boo! Are you going somewhere? They are. But don't worry, little Pishi. I'm going to stay here with you. No. Can't you think about how we're feeling right now? Nap, nap. I... I... See? Everyone's sad that we're leaving so suddenly. I know that, really. But we kind of did this scene already, and I'm not good at this sort of thing. And we can't expect a miraculous atmosphere breaker like when you fell on us, either. Please don't bring that up. I'm so sorry. This is my fault. No. No, it's all because of the other me sending Neptune here. Your constant apologizing is pretty damn annoying, lady. Um, I... I'm sorry. You're all assuming that they actually can go back. Sorry, I'm not convinced. But... But... What? Children can tell the cruelest of truths. Oh, come on, you guys. Don't grab onto me like this. Uh, nobody's grabbing onto me. Uh, fine. I've gotten used to it by now. Come on, Eastwar. Open a path for us. We're wasting time. You have grown strong, Neptune. Not by choice. You should prepare as well, Neptune. I am sorry you cannot say farewell properly, but... Nope. It's cool. You get it, right, Plutie? Uh -huh. But it's still sad. I don't get it at all. I don't want you to leave. Me neither. I hate it. Don't make this harder for Nep. I'm doing my best to keep a stiff upper lip after all. Jeez, I'm trying to tell you that we don't know if they can even go home or not. I think your eyes are getting a little watery. No, they're not. I uh, just uh, I yawned a second ago. Then why would you deny that your eyes are watery? I know you must be hurting inside, but we need to get home, Neptune. Yeah, I know. Okay, Isti, hit the lights. In the process now. Imagine yourselves releasing all the shares you have collected. Okay. Like this? Summoning a cool aura, maybe? Yeah! Okay. Now I will turn those... What is that? This is far more than I expected. We can succeed! With this many, it can be done! I am certain! Ah! Whoa! Whoa! I can't see! Did it work? I guess it did. But we got to this point last time, so... Nap Nap? Did she leave already? Nah, I'm still present and accounted for, but, uh... This is kind of a problem, isn't it? What the heck?! Wow... It's ginormous! It's so different than when Neppy Jr. fell on Noir. Big! Pretty! Uh-uh-uh, you mustn't get too close. You might end up falling on someone like Nepgear did. Please stop bringing that up. Isti, what the heck, girly? What's up with this thing? I would like to ask you the very same question. What sort of mischief have you stirred up this time, you two? That's the poorest way to put it in the history of putting things poorly. We did nothing wrong. She's being truthful. We just did our best to get as many shares as possible. 
Um, if this thing's this big, then maybe instead of just you two... Indeed. Could all of us pass through? You could, yes. In fact, you may be able to travel between the dimensions as you please. Which means... We never ever have to be separated from Nepnep? Neptuna won't go away? Darn tootin', kitties. Even if I walk into the light, I can come back whenever I want. Well, I cannot guarantee the whenever aspect. Okay, I want to go too! Yes, let's go together. Jeez, you got everyone all emotional for nothing. Wow, this is great! Isn't it, Nappy? No bawling on my watch. Nobody is listening to me. See? I told you it was pointless to create such a serious mood. I knew this would happen. You're trying way too hard. We feel relieved too. Is it safe to have created a game like this? We may have stepped into forbidden territory. Too late for that. Yes, you cannot delete something that you have already created. We don't have time for this. We gotta deal with the whole world ending plot right away. Yes, I understand. We will deal with this in due time. And there is nothing more promising than having all of you join together. Ugh, that almost sounded sappy and stuff, but there's no reason to be sad with this thing. Let's all hold hands and skip into the gate to the other game in this... Wait! Aw, come on, Iffy. That was the energetic end to the scene. Why are you butting in? If all of you travel over to that world, what happens here? Oh, good point. This world has its own share of problems, doesn't it? I'll stay here, but I don't think I can do that much all by myself. I'm just an information agent. It'd be best if we left one person in charge of each nation. That's not a bad idea, but... Whoever remains behind won't get the spotlight in any of the final scenes. I'm going because I said so! Um, sorry, Neppy Jr., but... What? No way! Neptune and I have priority seating on this flight! Hey, don't fight! Isn't this where you need to use the power of friendship to stand as one? I know this needlessly loud voice. Copy-paste? Hey there, buddies! We came to help out our friends who are in a pinch. But destroying this world, really? You're a bigger deal than I thought. Uh, no, I'm nothing special. <laughs> Modesty! Leave this side to us. Feel free to travel back and forth as you like. Go! He said to go, but, uh... He just said, leave it to us. Does he mean to say... It does not matter, does it? You must hurry over here and... Hmm? You are breaking up. Hi, sweetheart. Sorry for butting in. <sighs> the creeper. Did you just hack Isti? I'll be gone soon enough, so it's okay. For now, I would like to help you out. Nobody can gather information quite as well as moi. What's your game? There's no ulterior motive. You helped when I was in a bind, so allow me to repay you for that. I, I'm so sorry. I've caused you all a great deal of trouble. Don't worry. It was a stimulating experience, and I fell prey to a marvelous perk. Right, Noir? Don't remind me of those fakes! Aw, those two are like best friends, huh? Parting is such sweet sorrow, but I don't think this is the time for a long conversation. Mr. Bad will watch over Last Station, and the other two are heading your way now. 
And here I thought I could retire and spend my hard-earned money on my daughters. Father, are you okay? Please don't overdo it. Don't worry. This is a simple matter of moving the citizens to a safe location. It's easy enough for the man who used his business savvy for the good of all Louis. And with that, I may actually try hard for the first time in a long while. Ciao, cuties! The connection has returned. I wondered what I should do if such a thing happened, but... Aww, Daddy's gone! Welcome back, Isti! <sighs> he just says whatever he wants and vanishes! He did mention that two more are on their way here, no? Two others? If they're who I think they are, I doubt they'll be much help. We can hear you, you know! Could you not lump me together with this useless rat? I don't mind not being useful. I'd rather not walk around at such a dangerous time, chumps. Ooh, you two came too. Now we have the strength of 100 friends. A little girl and her little rat friend. Don't call me little girl. Stop wasting your time here. The children of both worlds are in deep trouble. Well, we've been trying to leave for quite a while. It's like a game of whack-a-mole, but instead of animals, more people keep popping up. No excuses! I don't get the whole situation, but I'll protect the children on this side with my life! So hurry up and do whatever it is you're supposed to do! Abnus. I heard you're the source of all this. We'll sit down for a nice long chat later. Oh. Please go easy on me. We'll leave all the work to you. I'll just chill over here and... If you say you'll help us, I'd be so happy, Mr. Mouse. It would mean so much to me. Let me at him! I'll fight the final boss alone if my lovely Kompa asks me to! He follows the formula to a T. If this many are hanging out back here, it should be okay. Right, Iffy? They're former enemies. So I'm a bit hesitant, but... Beggars can't be choosers. We're counting on you. I'll live up to the fiery trust you've placed in me. We'd do our best even if you didn't tell us to. Hey, Rat, quit swooning, would ya? Can it, you tiny broad? Only Kampa can command me. <sighs> what are you doing, Ray? Give us our orders. Huh? Um, me? You really seriously suck. But you're still our leader. Hurry up and command us. Where should I go, boss? If it's your order, I promise not to complain. You'd still listen to me? Cut her some slack. When women get older, their minds can't crank out ideas all that fast. Oh, he's making fun of my age, even now. But, but I understand. All of you, listen up. We can leave this to them, right? Uh-huh, they're nice people. Okay, Neptune, we should go. Yep, we're gonna slide on back to our world.
biggestie. We're back. Hello, Eastwar. Oh, you two. My goodness. Yes, welcome home. Oh, it's been like forever. It really feels like 10, maybe even 20 years. Uh, oh dear. Please refrain from grabbing onto me like that. Welcome home, Neptune. I mean it. Whoa. Big Isti is so big! Huh? Isti grew up? My Eastwar, don't grow up so fast and confuse poor Pishi. Don't be afraid. She's the same Eastwar at her core. Okay. Can I touch her? Welcome, all of you. Even though this world is in a desperate time, you still came. <laughs> is it okay to say nice to meet you at this point? Don't worry about us, Kevin. The problem originated in our dimension anyway. Not to rush you, but this isn't the time for niceties. Correct. Allow me to summarize our current situation. What's going on in here? There's a lot of noise. Guess? Not fair! How come Isti always gets to have fun? Whoa! It's Nepgear! Nepgear's back, you guys! Yay! It's Rom and Ram and Muni! The prodigal daughters return! Uh, sorry for the delay. Hey! When did you get back? You were supposed to hurry up and tell me the moment you returned. I missed you. Miss Nepgear? You're a real jerk for leaving me and Rom here! Oh, goodness. I'm sorry. Wait, you're all closing in on me pretty fast. Oh, I feel like it's been ages since anyone has made a fuss over me. Wow. Neppy Jr. is so popular over here. Yep, these miniature adults definitely prefer Nep Jr. Um... Pardon me, everyone. I am about to explain something rather important. Whoa! Whee! So many people! Doggy pile! Ooh. Oh, jeez. Hey! What are you doing to Rom? Wait, how are you? You're really tiny. Call me P! Things grew so lively in a split second. Um... Kids are... These short stacks are the kid sisters of this world, noir and blonde. I have sisters. Excuse me, this was not meant to be a time to make small talk. Huh? Why is my sister here? I thought she was... Uh, no, um, I'm... Hey, blonde's here too, huh? Wait, why are you dressed in red? You look like a candy cane. A candy cane, huh? Um... That's not our sister? They're the blonde and noir from the other dimension. They're the same, but not. What? Uh, ooh. Sorry. I just got really nervous for some reason. Uh, there's no reason to be nervous. If you act all formal, it'll just make me do it too. Um... Nice to meet you both. Nice to... meet you. Uh, is she really different? Are you sure she didn't just change clothes and trick you? She's... kinda different. But she... reminds me of Blonde. Everyone, I must demand that you listen to me at once. Whoa, this whole awkward dealie is so fresh and so clean. It's like a fresh start. Aw, Lucky! I want a miniature Plutie! I have my share of envy as well. But I suppose I do have the lovely little Pishi. Stop hugging me, Bert! Stop acting so timid! If you're supposed to be my sister, act a little more confident! Uh, I'm sorry. I guess the noir of their world is just as strict as mine. Oh, um, sorry. I didn't mean to put you down. Uh. 
I don't know what to say to these people. <laughs> You're kind of funny. I'm Ram. You're just lucky enough to become my friend. I am begging you to listen to my voice right now! And thus, five hours later... Huh? Did five hours really go by? No. About 30 minutes have, however. No matter what I did, none of you listened to me. I'm sorry. I got caught up in the moment. No need to get all moody. Is he angry? There, there. You didn't do anything wrong, Pishi. You were all always like this. I tried to be a diligent helper, and you all screw around. Hang on a sec. We were in the wrong, but this isn't the time to lecture us, right? Let's not waste any more time. <sighs> it pains me to hear that from you all, but you are right. I will briefly explain our status. Ray Wrights and her citizens' rights group used a mysterious power to destroy Planetune. It happened a few hours ago. But had you listened to me earlier, it would have been minutes ago. Uh, let's just move on. Continue, my diligent buddy. Around that time, a barrier was erected in the city, and copies of all of you began prowling around. To assess the situation, I have sent out the other CPUs. The CPU candidates were on standby here until you return. IF and COMPA are guiding people to safety. Standby sounds official and all, but we were just abandoned here like we needed to be babysat. Cheer up, Yumi. Here, let me pat your head to cheer you up. Yeah! <laughs> You're patting my head, not killing a bug! Don't mess up my hair! Do you truly intend to derail this conversation? Sorry! Any word from the other CPUs? None. The bombardment of the city has ceased, so I feel as though they have made some headway. As expected of us, I'm sure. Wow! Q3 are doing so well! Yeah! Blonde's awesome! Then we could just leave it to those three, couldn't we? Not a snowball's chance in my mouth. If we do that, I won't look like the main character. It won't be that easy, I'm sure. This is someone who transcended dimensions to attack our world. I know, I'm just saying. If things stay as they are, Planetune may be destroyed. You all must hurry and... Yep, gotcha. I don't need to be told to save the day or whatever. After this whole conversation, I think the sense of urgency has been lost completely. I've been away for a while, but it's my duty to protect my nation. If it were just Planetune, I wouldn't really care. But this threatens your whole world. A fight with someone who's not my sister, but basically is? Fine. I'm gonna try my best. <laughs> we get to meet the Noir and Blani and Vert of this world. We can come too, right? I don't want to stay here. Let's go with Ram! Whee! Of course. Let's all go together. I leave this in your hands, then. Please use your might to save Planetune and our game industry. Yeah!